What's up guys? And welcome to another episode, finally, of Bridge and Brooke, the trailer cooks. If this is your first time tuning in, I'm Bridget. Brookie's in the trailer, I'm gonna go get her. She's the star of the show, and we cook things here at the trailer. Now it is big, it is massive, it is a 10 foot 1971 vintage camper trailer that I remodeled. And like I said, Brookie's inside, so I'm gonna go get her. I'll tell you what is on today's menu. So just so you know, I'm checking in here from Elk Camp 2018 in the beautiful state of Idaho. This here is Brooke. Let's see if we can focus on Brooke. Brooke, say hey. Say hey, baby girl, look into it. <laughs> look into it. All right, so Brooke is all set up right there in her favorite spot and we're gonna get to cooking. On today's menu is so simple. Sounds so plain and boring, but it just is what it is. It's chicken and rice. Now, Brookie back there was telling me, why are we having chicken? You have so much elk and deer meat that you shot last year. I know, Brookie, I know. But I actually bought chicken to cook for during the week while I was in school and bring to class and then I never had the time to so now I have chicken that's gonna go bad and I better use it today so I can eat deer and elk the rest of the days that I'm out here at elk camp so chicken and rice it is well I just got this stuff the other day at the store it's something that I literally haven't had in years Brooke are you being good <laughs> it's rice aroni cheddar and broccoli sounds kind of good so what the heck I'm gonna make it okay so if you're watching this and you're thinking chicken and rice that's stupid that's easy I don't need to watch that and figure out how she makes it just know Brookie and I are gonna put our own little twist on it and we make all these catch and cook videos super fun so stay tuned okay so like I said it's literally been so long since I made one of these that I forgot that you put the rice and the seasoning and stuff Ooh. And first, with some oil or butter, all I have is oil, and you brown that, crisp that a little bit, and then add the water. So I'm gonna do that. Gotta give the camp shift some power first. It's really easy. Okay, the rice has browned enough. It's time to add some water. Okay, now we have to bring it to boil and while that's happening, I'm gonna shoot my bow a little bit. Okay, it's getting dark fast, but it's boiling so I'm gonna put it on simmer for 15 minutes. Okay, set up the target. That was a straight up bullseye, I promise, but you'll see. Both are on the target that I was shooting for, my little Morel foam target. This one I was aiming for that, this one I was aiming for that. Those are both super good, I'm very pleased with that. Not even going to do it again, just know that 20 is still on. Now we're going to move to 30. Okay, so they're both pretty good. This one I was aiming for the orange. So it's right above it. This one I was aiming for that white, so it's right on the corner of it. Not bad. Okay, I'm glad my bow's on. I'm drinking some iced tea straight out of the bottle. Unsweetened, this is my favorite. It's so refreshing. Okay, let's check on Brookie. I put her in the trailer for a little bit. I can get away with putting the chicken on now. The rice is coming along good, so. I'm gonna do that. All 
All right, you guys know me. I always keep it pretty simple on the seasonings. So today is no different. We're gonna use some garlic salt, focus, cayenne pepper, cause I like everything with a little bit of a kick and some Cajun seasoning. I think that'll go really good. Let's put some on. You know how before I was like, let's go check on Brookie? Look at the food, by the way. Coming along good. Well, we don't have to check on her because she's watching us. She's checking on us the entire time, huh, Brookie? From her little window. <laughs> she's so dang cute, look at her. She said, Mom, I know you want me inside because I'm kind of misbehaving, but I still want to be on your show. Watch this. <laughs> there she is. See, she steps away and then she attacks. That's why we have this sign. She's caviar and mascara. I'm corduroy and leather. Okay, chicken is all the way cooked. Ain't no doubt about it. This is off and done. Just got the camera lens all steamy, but that's looking good. I'm gonna turn that off as well. All right, all right, I'm eating in the trailer. I'm definitely gonna have more than that, but I wanna keep the everything in the pot so it stays warm. Let me have a couple bites and I'll tell you what I think. Hot, hold on. Mmm. So good. Well, there you have it, guys. I'm so happy I was able to do another Bridge and Brooke the trailer cooks. Right, Brooke? Right, Brooke? She don't care. I'm really happy, though, because you guys seem to like those videos, and I like them, too, because I'm already cooking anyway. I'm at my trailer. It's fun. Brookie has a good time being outside. It's just fun all together. It's a catchy little title. What do you think? Now, um, like I said, I am at Elk Camp in Idaho. That's where my trailer is now. So that's the location for this episode of Bridge and Brook the Trailer Cooks. Next, I want to know um, what you guys want to see me cook. I have a super top secret, super top secret, never been told fish taco recipe. And it's not like the Mexican fish taco that you would think. It's actually an Asian fish taco. Don't let that fool you. When I first heard that, I was like, no, I like Mexican fish tacos. Trust me, this is to die for. It's so, it has the weirdest cool ingredients and you eat it and it's incredible. So fish tacos. What do you think, Brooke? She's like, trout? I like trout, mom. I can also do a catch and cook with trout sometimes. Would you guys like to see that? I could do like avocado bacon elk burgers or deer burgers that sounds good i could do stuffed deer or elk burgers stuffed with cheese and jalapenos that sounds really really good i can pretty much do anything anything you guys want to see any recipe normally use like chicken beef or turkey i can use wild game and use elk or deer to make that so that's always fun so go ahead and comment below and let me know what you think before I leave you guys, one more thing, you know, I always like to mention um, my partners, the companies I work with, the companies I like, or my own company. First off, the Trying to Fish shirt you saw, that is available for men and women at my website where I make fly line bracelets out of mostly recycled fly line and sell fishing and hunting apparel. It's fablelifestyle.com. I'll put it here. There's a special discount code below for my YouTube watchers. Besides that, my hat. Whoosh is on track outdoors on track outdoors is company out of idaho i have a discount code with them as well it is bridget10 at on track outdoors.com that info and link is also below and last but not least my stove all my cookware is camp chef i love my camp chef stuff um i'd probably be living off cereal and oatmeal if it wasn't for it so bridge and brooke are very happy that we can cook in the trailer thanks again for watching the third ever episode of Bridge and Brook the Trailer Cooks. Okay guys, we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.